I have these three star patches, I guess you could call them right over here. And so I could say if I had one group of three star patches, how many star patches do I have? So I literally have one group of three star patches. Well, that means that I have three star patches. One, two, three. This is my one group of three. Now let's make it a little bit more interesting. Let's say that I had two groups. Let's say that I had two groups of three. So that's one group, and then here's a second group. Here's two groups of three. So how many total star patches do I have now? Well, I have two groups of three. Two groups of three. Or another way of thinking about it is this is three plus three. This is equal to three plus three, which is equal to six. Equal to six. So we see one times three. One group of three is three. Two groups of three, which is literally two threes, is six. Let's make it even more interesting. Let's have three groups of three. Three groups of three. Now what is this? going to be equal to. Well, it's three groups of three. So I could write this as three groups, three times three. And how many of these star patches do I now have? Well, this is going to be three plus three plus three. It's going to be three plus three plus three. Notice, I have three threes. I have two threes. I have one three. So this is three plus three plus three is equal to is equal to nine. And you can count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Or you could just count by threes. Three, six, nine. And I think you see where this is going. Let's, let's keep incrementing it. Let's get four groups of three. So let's think about what four times three is. One, two, three, and four. This right over here is four groups of three. We could write this down as four times three. Four times three, which is the same thing, which is the same thing as three plus three plus three plus three. Three plus three plus three plus three. Notice I have four threes. One three, two threes, three threes, four threes. One three, two threes, three threes, four threes. So we get three, six, nine, twelve. 12. So what I encourage you to do now, now that the video is almost over, is to keep going. I want you to figure out what five times three is. Five times three, and six times three, and seven times three, and eight times three, and nine, ti nine times three, and 10 times three. And I'll give you a little hint. You don't always have to draw the star patches, but it's nice to visualize it. We saw four times three is literally four threes. Well, five times three is going to be five threes. So two, three, four, five. Five, which is equal to three, six, nine, 12, 15. 15. So I encourage you to think about what all of these are after this video is done.